evening and thanks for joining us for Fox 21 Local News at 630. I'm Abby Bird and I'm Scott Kilroy. First on Fox 21 tonight, the Living Word Fellowship, now widely known as a cult, donated 28 acres along Highway 105 to the town of Palmer Lake a few years back after the group dissolved in the area. Since then, the property has cost the town money and created controversy across the community. The conflict surrounds six cabins and what people believe should be done with them. Fox 21's Aaron Bowling explains. I'm standing in one of six cabins that the town of Palmer Lake voted to demolish with the goal of preserving the land and creating open space for the entire community. However, some are fighting to keep these cabins with the goal of economic development and historical preservation. It has to generate revenue. You know, you can't. Otherwise, it just ends up being, you know, the gift that keeps on taking. It's costing the city money and eventually you can't sustain that. A former leadership group member of the Living Word Fellowship in Palmer Lake, Larry Bobo says he'd like to see the property preserved. He says in 2018, sexual abuse claims against the group led to its downfall. He doesn't believe there was sexual abuse in the cabins and says they could be used to make money for the city while still maintaining the property's trails. I know there's concerns about the cabins and whatever. There's, we didn't even use them. Those were just boarded up, so there really was nothing that went on. I would say there was spiritual abuse, but I wouldn't say there was sexual abuse. While those who'd like to keep the cabins say they're no longer in a floodplain and there's people who will pay for them, the mayor says they're beyond repair and that the community would be better served by a park and economic development in other areas. And we need to have those cabins down in order to do that. She says saving the cabins could be a burden, potentially requiring zoning and infrastructure changes. Aside from that, another member of the Living Word sent her a letter. I'm a survivor of the cult following and a former member of the Palmer Lake branch. Since some of the buildings will be revitalized, the letter asks for them to be used for mental health services. As for the cabins, the writer says that area would be best utilized as a garden of natural flora and for the community to enjoy. The mayor says a date has not been set for demolition. In Palmer Lake, Aaron Bowling, Fox 21 News. Aaron, thank you. Now the Towns Parks and Trails Commission has a special meeting and workshop to discuss the property. Tomorrow night takes place at 5 o'clock at the Palmer Lake Town Hall.